Warning, this channel is meant for viewers 21 plus and was created for educational and documentary purposes only. Beginner Buzz does not condone illegal activity and certainly does not sell anything. So don't even ask. Seriously. How's it growing everyone? Got a quick update for you today, but lots in the works. We got two full episodes coming on Prime Superior and the new Rosin Whip 2.0 by Rosin Evolution. But before we get into all that, we gotta see how this season's coming along. And today is all about seeing what those trichomes look like. Alright guys, so another week, another update. As you know, season took off a little bumpy, but we've ironed out the kinks, got ourselves a new nutrient system, and are excited to get through the rest of the season to try the next. If you guys haven't heard, the Green Sunshine Company is officially closed. Of course, that meant we had to find something else. So if you haven't seen our episode introducing Tea Labs, feel free to check it out. We'll link it in the description as always. Bugs are gone thanks to Prime Superior 2. Keep an eye out for an episode featuring a more in-depth look at their product as well as a giveaway featuring their entire product line. We've got the light figured out and despite the season's difficulty starting out, things aren't ultimately that bad. Fighting through germination, we ended up with a double grape by Mephisto and two peanut butter cookie autos by Taste Buds. We got the final top dressed in during last week's video, and although we've got to keep an eye on our CalMag and micronutrients still, it should be relatively simple to finish things up. Another week in though, and we're officially one week closer to harvest, and with that in mind, we better see how far along we are. So how exactly do we do that? Well, we look at the trichomes. Those who have been with us long enough know that we have this thingy. <laughs> it's actually a USB microscope that hooks right to our phone, getting us an up close look we need to see exactly what our trichomes look like, or rather what stage they're in. Simply put, trichomes are typically found in three stages, clear, cloudy, or amber. And to keep this as simple as possible, we'll just put it this way. Trichomes are clear when they're still young and developing, seen like this as soon as they appear in pre-flower, until sometime in end flower when they transition. Before this development though, clear trichomes are lacking in potency because they're still developing. As the plants grow older though, the buds fatten and firm and the trichomes begin to show signs of age. This is where things get good because now the plant is reaching maturity and with that, ripeness. For cannabis, this usually means the trichomes that have hopefully grown and swelled with the plant at this point will begin to turn from clear to cloudy, indicating maximum potency. Usually you should see them start to change about two weeks before the breeder's flowering time. But hold the phone, because although that may sound like the finish line for some, there's something left to consider. A fact. In the end, this isn't where trichomes end, as they will fade to amber if grows continue past the breeder's flower time. Of course, we all have the varying effects that we like, but if you like a weed that's going to knock you on your ass and have you strapped to the couch, this is where your amber comes in. Here's the thing, as the trichomes begin to fade to amber, they're essentially losing potency. Not fast, but there's an effect. But again, we come to the fact that everyone has their own taste. Like a weed that you can function with during the day? Well, probably find a solid sativa and harvest it to cloudy trichomes. Want a weed that's gonna get you sleep for the first time in a month and deal with that back pain? Indica, and hell, how hard you wanna get hit? Little love tap? Let the plant go until you see that about 10% of the trichomes have turned amber while all the rest are still cloudy. Want to get hit a little harder, but not so bad the airbags go off? 25%. Totaled? Fuck it. Go 50%. Or more. You're the ultimate judge. That's what makes this so great. For us, we like to harvest right around that 10 or 20% amber, but we like something you can feel in the body. 
As for these ladies, well, as you can see, they're still a little clear, but that's exactly what we expected. We're a little early, just keeping an eye on things, but we're right where we should be. Can't wait to see these babies shift over the next few weeks, and even better yet, we can't wait to start this new season with Compost Tea Labs. Keep an eye out for these videos on Prime Superior and Rosin Evolution, and until then, keep learning, keep growing. Catch, Catch you later, guys. guys.